I have a very... Hmm? Hi, hi. <laughs> I have a very busy day planned. I have a lot of things to do. My wife's mother was here. She was staying here for a couple of days. She just left. It's 9.30 now. So it's time for me to start doing my fixing and cleaning and taking care of him. Will be a busy day today. I have a lot of things to do. I actually have to write a note because I also will forget the things I need to do. So there's a sofa that's kind of broken that I need to fix. And uh, Zeiss is also kind of broken while well, getting broken. And my keyboards, the keys keep falling off. Which is very annoying. <laughs> the laptop that we use to watch television, to watch uh, Dutch CDs and such. It's kind of broken. I also need to put the uh, bicycle helmets on the wall. That's something I haven't been able to do yet because I did not have the correct things, the correct pins. I also need to clean the air conditioners and we received some kind of like gloves, toy thing for my kids, for my wife's uh, colleague. And the glue became loose, so I also need to fix that. And my kid's beetle, one of his legs called broken off. Let's start with the air conditioning because those will probably take the longest anyway. He really likes helping me but most of the time he just gets in the way. <laughs> but he's learning. I don't know why I can't fix electronics that easily and like figure out how things work. But it's kind of helpful. <laughs> we don't need to pay anybody to clean the air conditioning here because that's kind of expensive. Like these things are already expensive, we have three in our house. Also, if you live in Japan, have some kind of bottle. Because you never know when insects enter your room. This one time we had this huntsman spider on the wall. <laughs> I woke up, saw that massive spider on the wall, and I had no idea what to do. But I think we found a problem, it's just wet. We use it at night, and I think it probably hasn't been able to dry properly yet, but that's not a good thing. There's not really much use in spraying with this thing now, because it's wet, so I'll probably have to dry it first. And then I'll have to try using the air can. I just realized I shouldn't put it on dry because now the dust can go a lot more freely inside of it. So I need to wait until the filters are dry before I can continue. And I already washed the filters of the other one. Like we have two of the exact same ones. So I cannot do that right now. Uh... Okay, well, oh, so can I. I actually tried to do this some time ago by using these with like a sticker on the back. It did not work, I prefer to make a hole into the walls and just fill them with some uh, filler when we move out of this apartment. So we have one, two and three helmets and uh, right now they take up quite a lot of space on our little table, well table, on our little shoe closet. I don't know how to call that thing. I made markings on the wall, so normally this should not be a problem if I can find the markings. Hey. Next task. The thing that I will do right now is clean the cooking pots like I was able to clean a little bit of it so I guess I can make them completely pika pika again but I also forgot to charge the camera that's why the camera is in this very strange angle right now and that is how useful those child locks are on the furnaces he always puts them on and then I cannot use the gas so 
he is making it baby safe even this lock he can open it but he prefers to close it when he sees that it's open this box contains a cooking knives this baby helps in so many ways um, maybe I should teach him more baby stuff but he helps with preparing the table, he cleans the table, like he brings all the dishes to the kitchen. When we do the laundry, like when oh, oh well, there's cook. When the laundry is wet and we have to hang it out, he helps hanging everything. He does a terrible job, but he helps. He does more than my brothers ever did. And when the laundry is ready, I take it inside and he starts folding it. Also in a very terrible way, but at least he helps. And now back to cleaning the pots. With some hot water and some of this magical juice, I can clean it. I'm not quite done yet, but before, after. It's already 10.30, I feel like I haven't done that much yet. And yeah, we eat at around 11. Um, I try to make him fall asleep early, so we eat lunch at 11. And I feed him his dinner at 5 o'clock, and I hope he falls asleep by 6 o'clock. I haven't been able to clean yet, so if the house looks messy, it will be fixed by the evening. <laughs> Before my wife gets back home from work. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so today is lunch. Onion soup together with roasted pan. He does not eat lettuce, that's my part. But we basically have the same thing. I always add rice to the soup, just because soup on its own does not fill me enough. And his tea. And that's our lunch. I don't give him too much because he will probably fall asleep. I don't give myself too much because I'll probably have more food afterwards when he's asleep. <laughs> There is a construction happening next to our house, so it's kind of noisy. I don't know if my camera's microphone will pick up the sounds. My kid is watching some TV while finishing his lunch. And I was finally, finally able to put it on the cleaning function, on the drying fun self drying function. So let's see how long this takes. And then I can finally clean that one properly. He does not want to fall asleep, so we'll go to the library instead. I still have some books I need to return. This is the second time we will go out today, because this morning we went to the park. <laughs> Normally, he sleeps right now. He refuses. <laughs> and whilst we're gone, that one is on cleaning, and that one is also on cleaning. And that one is cleaning the floor with his t-shirt. We finally got home, but it's so hot today. It's really starting to become summer. I'll do some work and I think we'll have an early shower. <laughs> I often make this bread pudding when they have bread at a big discount in my local supermarket, <laughs> which is quite often. And she is slowly becoming 
sleepy. Okay, so I'm done cleaning it. There's still a little amount, like, there's still a little amount inside, but before I turn on the air conditioning to try to capture the rest, I will first spray this with water so everything that flies out and touches this plastic, that it stays inside of the plastic. <laughs> Normally I will be taking off the entire thing, but I have other things to do today, so. Next up on my to-do list, so I finished cleaning the house, everything looks good again and he, yeah, he blocks the entire view. When I built my PC here in Japan, I had a very low table, the kind of the same height as this table. So I had this chair as my office desk, uh, my office chair or my desk chair. The problem is I can feel the metal through it, I already refilled this with extra padding and such because it was very flat now it's a very very soft chair again except for this part everything keeps going down here so i'll have to open it up again basically all our sofas like this one and our big one were so bad that we ended up just buying a carpet instead and using this as our sofa. This carpet is a lot more comfortable. <laughs> I, I'm my cameraman. This carpet is a lot more comfortable than our sofa because our sofa had metal pieces sticking out of it. Oh, and he touched the lens. Okay, well, chair is fixed. It's nice and fluffy again. And... Living is clean. And this is our big sofa and we put it in the hobby room for now because I put it all the way up. But also... <sighs> so every time when I want to film to make the audio sound better because there's a lot of echoing going around. I put it like this and I create some kind of wall. So this is basically what's behind the camera. Um, it's here because this bar like this metal bar here, and when you sit on it, you can very easily fill it. I, I tried to put another thing over here, but you can still feel the metal when you sit down on it. And there's now kind of sharp pins sticking out. So it's probably kind of difficult to see, but this is a metal pin sticking out of it. I've been trying to fix this metal pin now for a couple of times, but I can never find it when I open it, but today is the day that I will finally fix this sofa before my kid hurts himself on it. I found out what the culprit is to keep the fabric into this area there's a plastic rod keeping it there the problem is it's just it like it broke and um, i cannot fix that so i'll just have to cut that rod on a more convenient location that it does not try to kill us i'm also very surprised every time when we go outside to the park he becomes sleepy and takes an afternoon nap we went outside twice and four times went to the park and he still is not sleepy. Um, I got this one, but where's my other one? Ah. Ah. <sighs> Finally got it. It was harder than I thought. <laughs> I'm not good with tiny things, I don't have fine skills in my hands. That has been a weakness of me for a very, very long time. 
I cannot do fine work at all. I'll probably get glue on my mouse mat and on my hands. But this is basically practically before I start doing my keys. Well, I, I basically have two control keys and two shift keys, so I could... Oh, oh! Look, that's what I mean, it's already leaking out. I, di I did not take paper. Oh no, let's, let's get some paper. Oi! Okay, um, 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 okay, this is gel kind, I think. So what if I do this? This is not going to work, like, it's not that noticeable that his ashi is gone, that his leg is gone, but... I thought I had a chance of fixing it, apparently not. But that makes me wonder, this is also kind of small. Will I be able to fix this part or not? Okay, so this is one key done. Are there any other keys broken? There were multiple bro- yeah, this one as well. Whilst I'm fixing the keyboard, he's just laying there. He's sleepy, but every time when he's sleepy, he kind of refuses to actually fall asleep. Uh -huh. I'll quickly wake him up, quickly put him in bath before he sleeps too deeply. And let's hope I didn't put any glue on any other parts where glue is not supposed to be. <sighs> Why can I never have, like, an easy day? <laughs> Why is there always way too much to do? Oi! 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 Well, at least I have time to do all things now. Okay, we have different glue. This glue is a little bit more annoying because that one actually sticks to your skin. The other one, because yeah, it was kind of easy to go away. So this one came loose. I, I think she used some kind of tape. Come on. I see glue on this. Sorry, twist this down. I forgot about that. They have little squeaky things. I just got out of the shower. The little one is still sleeping and I will study now. I feel more comfortable now that I'm clean again. So I'll quickly study because um, since 12 days ago, 13 days ago, I actually started daily studying Japanese again because it's kind of needed. This is for the N2. I have not started it yet. This is the first time I'll try. I have not specifically studied for the DLPT N2 yet. I've just been reviewing my old things that I had in my Anki and that's about it. So I really wonder how I will do on this. Are, am I ready at this point for the N2? Or should I study a lot more? Probably study a lot more, but let's see. After I made my Kohi, I really want my Kohi. I cannot get him to wake up. He has been sleeping for one and a half hours. He'll probably sleep a little bit longer. I'm getting kind of sleepy myself, so I'll join him for a bit. <laughs> so I try taking a nap to get it at him. The problem is I am not really able to have midnight, uh, like midday naps. So yeah, I started working on another thing. We have a laptop connected to the television so I can use the internet, use a browser to use Belgium television stations on my TV. I don't use Windows at all, I am not a big fan. So I use Linux instead because there's not really any other alternative. Problem is, I updated it to the new version and it does not really work that well anymore, so I will throw everything off and install Linux from scratch, but not Linux Mint, Arts Linux, which requires a little bit more work. It works a lot smoother. And it's already 5 o'clock. After that I'll have to do some cooking. He will probably wake up. I hope he will be able to fall asleep at night. First a quick little update to Google Drive. One hour remaining.
<laughs> it's almost seven o'clock now, so yeah, he slept a lot. I'm still working on fixing the laptop that's connected to the television. Oh, it's getting kind of dark, it's getting kind of late. I'll make an end to this video. For the rest of the evening, I'll, I'll give him his food. My wife is supposed to come home anytime, like she's, still, she's having overwork again. I'm not that happy with the little amount of work I was able to do today. I wanted to do more. So, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> mm.